To sell more products in print-on-demand, you need to use something that will display the product in a nice way. On Printify, you get some mockups that show the product as it should look after the printing. But what if you'd like to show the product in a different way? You can use a website like Placeit. This site shows products in different ways, even in videos, with only the product design changing. You can get some mockups for free. But if you want to use the Printify integration, you need to pay. It costs $89 per year and you can cancel any time for refund. It's about $7 per month, which is not a huge investment. But the question is, will it help you in your situation? Well, let's see. When you browse the designs on their website, it may seem like they have a lot of options, but when you search for a specific item, you'll find fewer designs, though there is still a very good selection. It actually depends on the product you're selling on Printify. If you sell popular products, you'll have many options options, but if you are selling something niche, you might not find what you need. So be sure to search Placeit before buying the subscription. You can try it for free and I have an affiliate link in the description. If you'd like to support my channel, make sure to buy the subscription before you click on the Placeit button in Printify Mockup Editor. But don't buy it until you check if they have what you're looking for. For a disclaimer, I'm not a user of Placeit because I didn't find mockups for the product I sell. I mostly sell baby and in kids products, mainly for girls. When I search for mockups, I get only a few options and most of them are for boys or parents with babies. So it doesn't help me. But if you sell adults t-shirts, you'll find many more options. For kids products, they have a bigger selection of designs. If you sell mugs, you'll also find a lot of options on their website. So it really depends on your needs. You also need to check the mockups that are similar to Printify product. So it shows a realistic product to your customer. Now let's see how to integrate it with Printify. After you create a product, you can go to the mockup library. If you missed that or want to add it to an existing product, you can click on the product and go to the mockup library. Click on place it and you'll see a button. Click it and you'll see the catalog where you can search for products. You don't need to be logged in to view the catalog, but when you want to download the image, you need a paid account. On place it, they have some mockups with names, but when you try to search for the exact name in Printify, it won't find it. The nice thing about this integration is that you can get the exact color of the product in the mockup. You do need to create a separate mockup for each color though, but the mockup you create won't be linked to a specific color. Here's the thing, when you create product variation on Printify, the product will automatically update the mockup color when a customer selects a different variation on your store. But when you create a mockup with the Placeit integration, it won't be linked to the product. However, you can link it after creating it on the website you upload it to. I'll show you how on WooCommerce after we create the mockup. To create a mockup with Placeit, it's pretty simple because all the information is already on Printify. You don't need to upload the mockup image again. Just click the mockup, choose a color from your variations, and you can see the product ready for you to download. You can adjust some of the design placement. To change the design placement on the mockup, choose the mockup and then click edit. Now you can move the image around until it's in a good position. If you like the new placement, click apply. If you want to go back, just click reset and close the mockup. When you save it, it will download to your mockup library on the site. You can also download it to use in other ways to promote the product. That's it, very simple. If you want better search option, you can use Placeit directly. Download the mockup from there after you upload your design, then go back to Printify, click on library and choose upload by me to upload the, the new image. You can do this with any other website that allow you to create mockups. The same rules apply, the mockup will upload, but it won't link to any product variation. On the next page, you can set it as the main image for the product. Now let's see how to connect the product variation. First, you need to publish the product from Printify with all the images, so all the variation are set up and linked to Printify. This way, when someone orders, the correct variation is sent for printing. Go to your WooCommerce store, click on the product you want to update and go to the variation section under the description. You'll see all the options for each color and size. If you have a variation for the color white, you need to update all the variation with the white color and different sizes. 
click edit next to the first white variation for this example. You can link one image to each variation, but the other color mockups can be added to the product's image gallery. If there is already an image there, remove it, then open your gallery and choose the right image or upload a new one. This will set that image as the main image for that color the color variation. If you also want the mockup to show in the product gallery and, it, and you uploaded a new image, add the image to the gallery too. If you are using the Printify and Place It integration, just create all the variation in Printify. It will push the images to your website and then you can change the images in the variation and adjust the placement of the images in the gallery. So all the color mockups will be in the same group and it will switch to the right one when clicked. There are also other plugins that can help you make the variation more interesting in WooCommerce, like adding galleries and cute buttons, but this is the basic way without using any plugins. In the same way you link the image to the variation in WooCommerce, you can do it on other platforms too. Just look for the image for each variation and change it. If you are creating task magic automation and want to use Placeit for the product while you upload them to Printify, you can add all the clicks in the automation to select the image mockup from Placeit. If you don't know what I'm talking about with Task Magic Automation, watch this video, like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.